well, he can triumph over another demon known as Dakpo in this grand final set. Now, will Austin triumph or will he run into the Dak police? Oh. Will there be a no fun zone allowed? We will find out. We're going to see. So it's going to be a classic matchup. Zero Suit versus Ness starting on Dreamland. The Interesting. Best stage. Because this is they pick, considered they pick the world to win. One yes, of they pick the world to win. <laughs> this is considered one of Zero Suit's best counter picks. So I, they basically started out on Zero Suit's counter pick. Honestly, that said, I think Ness does phenomenally well on this stage as well. You're not wrong. He does really good with the early back throw kills on this stage because of the heights. He also has those up air kills. And you got to wonder. Like, I guess. If this is their neutral, what's the counter pick? <laughs> exactly. Oh, uh, uh, you know what? I would not be, you know, against a grand finals of all Dreamland. N neither would I. To be I honest. would love that. They got great music. Am I guys look at Wispy all day. You know I what don't we care. also have is a pretty great neutral game coming out of both of these players. Austin not committing too hard to anything, and neither is Dakpo just kind of sitting back, making sh sure that he throws out those nares and the paralyzers. Yeah, like you said, not committing too much. He just, like... Uh, oh, but when the punish game happens, it happens. It is happened. But Dakpo, not, you know, not going for the full, you know, down throw, down up air, up air into a B, just for two up airs. See, it's right there. One up air. He's content with racking a percent right now, and so is Austin. But he's oh, also but the content shield with really solid. up air. Mm -hmm. Killing him at under 100%, I believe. Really, yeah. really solid. Yes, really good, really strong, especially... Uh, <laughs> When you get the read that hard, uh, Austin's going to need to find a way to take off the stock, which he can find it soon as Zero Suit Samus is reaching those back throw kill mm -hmm. Yeah, without the rage, I don't know about this early, but ooh, ooh, he there, might though. not need it with that up air. That Austin, up air. I have noticed, instead of going for chasing his opponents in the air, really likes to juggle them with that with that uh, PK Thunder. Exactly, but, but he also likes to seal stocks very commandingly, like he just did with that up air, which we're probably going to see a lot more of in the set. Mm -hmm. Dakpo, though, commenting before about how other players don't really know how to deal with that move, you attack through it. And Dakpo, knowing how to deal with it, it's not going to be nearly as effective against him as just following him and fading out air dodges would be. Exactly. With a player who adapts as well as Austin, I'm, I'm sure oh, and that again. he will find his opportunity. DIing the uppies. That was Not the best. His second perfect shield up B. He was telling me he's been working on that tech that's probably that perfect parry yeah. up B out of shield. Yeah, so what's what's coming into play here is I think Austin's lack of uh matchup experience. About, yeah, matchup knowledge uh, against Zero Suit Samus. I, I don't believe that Austin's aware that uh, you should DI down in a way uh Zero Suit Samus is up B. <laughs> I but I'm sure that he will um, adapt Sam later on. Sam, making sure to say it set. loud enough I for. Uh, I'm just commentating. Making sure to speak loud enough for Austin to hear right. him because he wants some exciting games. But I Dak, Dak I, Poe, I want to do anything. Yeah. Come <laughs> <on>. <laughs> but hey, okay. I'm strictly unbiased in this commentary. Legitimately though, right now, uh, I think that we are figuring out the style of play that Dak Poe is. Definitely, I would pin him as more of a defensive player because most of his kills were out of shield punishes. Yes. You know, unsafe approaches on his shield. He got that perfect shield, up B. He didn't go for the crazy, you know, I'm going to read your air dodge and then catch you with the up B. He knows Ness is floaty, hard to catch. Yeah. He's just going to get that guaranteed one. And this is a duck hunt, which I actually think is Ness's best stage. Uh, really? Definitely a, a solid. I always see Ness players, you know, counterpick to the stage. That's uh, interesting. Yeah, it's, it feels like a good stage. I feel like the sides are good for back ah, throw. Yeah. And it's good because you can ride the wall with the PK Thunder and then yeah. get a second opportunity to yeah. do it. Any stage where you, you get the ability to, uh, you know, up your recovery is mm -hmm. amazing as well. Yeah, especially when you are a character like Ness who does struggle a little bit in that department. Exactly. But also, this stage is one of Dakmo's favorites as well. Uh, lo loving to utilize the platforms and the birds. Oh my goodness! That and early kill coming Austin play. still not DIing that properly. But yes. <laughs> and what we're seeing here is what I've what I've noticed about watching. Oh that, my it's not god! Yet. Yep, as you were saying, those, yeah. those walls. Yeah. If it were any play. other stage, that would have been the quickest two zero and a handshake I've ever seen. But wh wh what I've noticed from watching Austin versus watching Dakpo is because Austin doesn't have the matchup experience nearly as much, he'll go for a lot of, like, old school, like, it's this game is too new for me to say anything's old school, but he'll go for some old school player tactics, like the the roll-behind grab, 
or the roll behind do other things. But Dagpo, known for punishing his rolls, I want to see how dirty it can get. Yes. Uh, Austin trying to go for the cheese there to steal that stock. Oh, not, even, not getting the oh, punish. Oh, the runoff the back air. That Austin living with some crazy percents. Yeah, yeah, and and the recovery. It. it seems that matchup and experience is just a little bit too much for Austin to handle. And his crazy loser's run. <laughs> he did it, yeah, he did it the last time. His, his crazy <laughs> loser's <laughs> run was was come to a screeching halt by the DAC police. Yep. No fun allowed. Send him to jail. No fun allowed. No fun here. Zuzu Samus will send you to the blast zone. In all honesty. 2-0 and a handshake. In all honesty, Mr. though. FXFW Dakpo. That was a really fun set. We got to see some amazing play from these players. Oh, Dakpo came in.